So Microsoft have recently axed a Nokia name for a mere 1.9 billion pounds. Do you accept cash? And now rumors of the new Microsoft phone have surfaced. And yes, it's likely to be called the Surface Phone. And the images you see here are what the phone might look like. And from what we heard, this phone may surface in October, but will likely be unveiled early 2016. So let's run through the expected specs real quick. We should hope to see a 5.5 inch AMOLED screen, which is 1440 by 2560 pixels with four gigabytes of RAM. Inside, we'll have a 64 gigabyte storage up to 128 gigabytes as well as an Intel Atom X3 chipset, codenamed Sophia. And on the back of the phone, we should have a 21 megapixel pure view Zeiss six lens camera. And on the front, we'll have an impressive eight megapixel Zeiss wide angled front camera. So the word on the street is at the October event, we will see two new Lumia handsets, the 950 and 950 XL. Terry Myerson from Microsoft said that in 2015 to 2016, we're to focus on a few great devices that head in the direction of the premium branded segment of the market. So what's he on about? Is he talking about the Lumias or the yet to surface Surface Phone? Codename Juggernaut Alpha. I'm the Juggernaut! So anyway, let's move on to the next section I like to call taking a leak. So I heard the new Surface Phone is so powerful that it can erase bad memories. Happy trails, man especially the horrible ones about Windows 8. Also, I heard it might be able to project a life-size, scantily dressed version of Cortana from its surface, just like that scene with Princess Leia. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. So at this point, we can only hope. If you hear anything about these upcoming features on the Surface phone, then let us know at walkgear.net. So I'm quite excited about these expected specs. My only concern is, as a potential customer, have Windows even begun to scratch the surface of what their rivals Google and Apple have done in the way of apps. So thanks for watching, see you in the next one. Don't be late.